Good morning, Pre-K 1. Good morning, Pre-K 2. Welcome back for another edition of Math with Ms. Tolman. I hope you all had a great week and we missed you terribly. This is how we can see you, so I'm going to keep these videos coming and I hope that you are staying safe and well, listening, learning, and growing every day. So let's get started. First of all, I have to give you my big hug. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Awesome. All right, so I'm going to review. I told you last week we were going to do numbers 6 through 10. These are numbers 1 through 5, but I want to review all the different ways that we made the numbers last week. So we made dot numbers. We showed you the way to make it with the dice, with the dot numbers. And we did the 10 frame. We're going to really look at 10 frame today. We also did tally marks, fingers, and stars. But this week, instead of stars, we're going to do something yummy, yummy, yummy in your tummy, tummy, tummy. It's going to be something that you can eat. So if you do it with mommy and daddy later, you can say, help me count, then help me eat. But that's coming up in a second. So let's review. When we have our 10 frame, we have five numbers at the top, five numbers at the bottom. We fill in the first five, and then we fill in the next five. Because remember, five plus five make 10, right? So we're gonna go past five, and we're gonna start with the first number past five today, which is six. So let's review these are the dot cards for one, two, three, four, and five. We're gonna do some more of that later, but we're gonna mainly focus today on the 10 frame and the way we mix them with the stars, okay? Are you ready? Yay, let's get started. Who remembers from last week what number this shows from our 10 frame? That's right, five. So we're gonna make each number past five. We're going from six to 10. I'm gonna put five there and I have one more. Five plus one make, yay, six, you're so smart. Then I have six and I add one more. Six plus one make seven on a roll. When I have seven and I add one more, I have eight. Great job, keep it up. I have eight and now I add one more. I have nine, yay. And last but not least, if I have them all in my 10 frame, I have 10. I have five green and five blue. Because remember, five plus five make 10. So now I'm gonna do them out of order from six to 10 and you're gonna show me and then we get to practice with our yummy food. What number is that? Six. What number is that? Eight. What number do you see? Seven. What number is this again when our whole 10 frame is complete? 10, great job. If I take one away, I have nine. If I take another away, I have Hey, great job, you're so smart. Another one, if I take away, I have seven. I have my five and my two, that makes seven. If I take another away, I have six. So if you can remember that we started with five and we're adding on, we go five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. As promised, it's now time for us to remember what we just learned using food. So if you can use this with cookies, with grapes, with pieces of fruit or snacks, whatever you may have if you wanna practice at home. But today, I have some yummy muffins. Are we ready to remember how to recognize our 10 frame numbers using our muffins? All right, 
here we go. You guys are on a roll. Do we remember what number this represents? We have five on the first row and one on the bottom. And that makes six. Great. Let's try another one. We have five muffins on the first row and three on the bottom. Do you remember, boys and girls, what number that makes? That's right, eight. All right, we have five and five, and we know this because we've said it so many times. Five and five make 10. That's right, 10 muffins. What do we have now? Five and two make seven. Now let's try one more. We have five on the first row. Then we're gonna count on six, seven, eight, nine. So we have in all nine muffins. So we're doing addition too. We're adding on to five. We have our first row of five and we keep adding muffins or taking away muffins. Let's review one more time our number six through 10. We have six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Great job. Have fun eating your snacks. So I hope you had fun practicing the numbers six through 10 with the 10 frame. We did it with our muffins and we did it with the magnetic dots. But I also wanna show you how to make the numbers and review that with you as well. And then we'll explore, I know we didn't do tally marks and the dots, but we will do more of those because we have more time together. So today I wanted to focus on the 10 frames and how to recognize the number six through 10. Now we're gonna practice and end our lesson by writing the number so you can write along with me. Are we ready? Okay. Curve around and curve it up. Curve around and curl it up. Curve around and curl it up to make the numeral six. Come to the right and slide it down. Slide to the right and slant it down. Slide to the right and slant it down to make the numeral seven. Close the gate, make an S and close the gate, make an S and close the gate to make the numeral eight. Make a circle, then a line, make a circle, then a line, make a circle, then a line to make the numeral nine. Come right down and make a zero. Come right down and make a zero. Come right down and make a zero to make the number 10. That's the end. All right, so we practiced today six through 10. We practice again with our uh, 10 frame and with our muffins also with the 10 frame we will also practice more as the weeks go on thank you for remaining safe thank you for joining me i wish you well i'm missing you so much but at least i get a chance to come into your living rooms and see you and you get to see me and i love you so much until we meet again bye bye